Um, Quentin is a film historian, and uh, he's a cinema master, and uh, and a, a a curator of pop culture, and so he brings that sensibility and that uh, 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 masterful uh, ability to bring all of those elements together and 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 write the script and shoot the film and infuse it with great uh, music and. Uh, and hopefully uh, wonderful performances and stuff. How does one prepare to play a 1858 white guy with a white supremacist approach to reality? Uh, you know, uh, I did a lot of research. I did a lot of reading. I'm a fan of that uh, era of, uh, of literature anyway. I've read, I've read a lot about that era uh, long before the movie. And uh, so I went back and I, I revisited a lot of the books and a lot of the research that I or, the things that I read for pleasure that now I turned into research and I started to layer it in intellectually and then emotionally and then spiritually and because um, for me uh, building a character is all about preparation so that by the time you get there you can uh, you have great freedom you can just play. Would you say uh, Don that this is a story of uh, liberation? Um, yes I think that uh, this is a story of shining the light on slavery and human subjugation of any kind and uh, um, and vindication for for the uh, the uh, the enslaved um, and uh, you know there's a shot at the end of the movie where one of the slaves in the in the cage is looking at Django riding away on the um, on the on, on the horse going back to to save his love and there's a look in his eye and it's it's uniquely Tarantino of him saying, perhaps this was the beginning of Martin Luther King or Gandhi or, or any number of great uh, um, prophets who, who brought about the, uh, the, the, the awareness and, the, and fought for the, those who are, uh, are less fortunate and more enslaved. So from all the work you've done, which is the one you feel the proudest of and why? Oh or my gosh, there's, there's so many. It's, it would be unfair for me to try and choose one over the other, but uh, I would have to say uh, that uh, working with Quentin was, uh, was tr right, it was equal to, um, if not the best experience of my career.